scary, scary situation in Totten, Massachusetts. Uh, a man there accused of biting a gas station clerk twice in the face. Oh, James. Come on. During a bloody attack. I would... I would... I wouldn't have anything left to live for if that were to happen to me at the gas station. <laughs> it is uh, a real scary story. Here's oh. the latest on it from Boston 25 News. Yes, Mark, the regular customer telling us he's never seen anything so sick and twisted. He put his initial disbelief aside to stop the suspect who's accused of taking a bite out of the clerk's face here, then licking and playing with the blood. She just at me like a feral cat. <gasps> it's an animalistic attack now ingrained in Michael Keegan's mind. It was really bizarre. It unfolded before his eyes, before he could make it to the counter at this Sunoco. Keegan says he was stunned seeing a chunk of the oh, coach face uh, being good. bitten off. Jesus. And it got even more strange. She spit the, the piece out on the floor and then she said, I don't eat flesh, I drink blood. And I'm like, oh, my God. That sickening statement, he says, was made by 19-year-old Joel Davila, seen blowing a kiss to family members and smiling during his arraignment on charges of assault oh with intent God. to maim and mayhem. Like Police say Bruno Davila Mars. also chopped yeah. down on clerk Scott Trainer's elbow after being confronted about stealing a bottled drink. She had played finger paints in it, and she had licked it and put it all over her face. And I'm just, I was just like, wow, you are out there. <laughs> Keegan describes it as demented, but he says he was determined to make sure Davila didn't escape, keeping him in place while on the phone with 911. I told her if she took one more step towards me, I was going to knock her teeth down her throat. A police report describing officers <laughs> looking for the guy. victim's He's missing awesome. flesh at the bloody scene, to which Davila reportedly said, quote, I think I ate it. You can cut my stomach open to check. Jesus. He doesn't bother nobody, Scott. He's one of the nicest guys in the world. Come on now. Uh, this right here is when uh, the psychopath man girl <laughs> uh, bit a ju giant chunk out of my face. Also here on my elbow, this giant missing spot. Jesus. So that Same uh, man woman. Witness Michael Keegan, who they interviewed. He wasn't the one attacked. He was. No. He just watched everything unfold. That's we need to get that guy on the show. He's amazing. He is. Someone said, In that guy walked right by my house with a crop top on and yoga pants. Instantly, I knew something was wrong. Oh, yeah. yeah. You can just look at him. You can. Tell. You can look at his mug shots. You, you know. That picture that guy took of him at the store. Yeah. yeah. Where he's on his knees. Mm -hmm. He yes. looked freaking insane. Yeah. It's well, crazy he... in court. Yeah. yeah it's totally, he is crazy. Uh, yeah. Like, maybe. Really, high. really sick. And that's his second attack. He attacked someone else? Come on now. Keeps it up, he'll go to prison, and can you imagine how that visit will be? Transgender punky Chewster ate another guy's face. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta admit, I like the name. Me, punky, punky Chewster. Chewster. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a sick, not sick man, but working on uh, our, our computer. We're, we have massive internet problems this morning, Aww. and I don't think it's limited to us. I think other people are having them too. But wait, oh, here we go. May have just come up here. Oh, ate another wow. guy's face in a throwdown before he ate the clerk's face at that <laughs> gas station. So he's just a face-eating son of a bitch. He is. Oh, man, he is confident. Can he I is. tell you? He in those is. yoga pants and crop top. He is confident. It's like you and put, he shouldn't Put be. Chuck in yoga pants and a crop top. He shouldn't. You'll get a similar look. I think Chuck would look better in yoga pants and a crop top. Oh, I start together. wearing yoga pants and coming in in a half shirt <laughs> out of nowhere and Please. start doing my eyebrows. Get you some Please. Help. Then you better know better watch that yourself something around. is wrong. James, I don't. I think James is okay. I, the thought of you in yoga pants, I think, made him. Okay? I think maybe he pooped himself, or, or I don't what know. Happened? Something, something happened. He had to rush out. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> something did happen. What's I don't know. Did he get something in his eyes? I maybe. Know, maybe. Or he sharded. I don't know. What's going on? We'll get something to the update. Eyes, <laughs> we'll see. Something um, happened. The thought of you in yoga pants and a crop top just sent him right over the edge there. I think he may have fell off his chair. No, he's okay. <laughs> he's all right. <laughs> James, are you okay? What did you? Well, I'm sorry, I just spit Red Bull all over the place. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it went up in the air and then straight all into my eyes and. It burns. It burns so bad. Well, yeah. Yes. Yes. It would. It would burn bad for sure. That's not what I expected from what I saw through the window. I, what happened? I, was I like, felt oh. like somebody just spit poison venom in my face. Oh, my God. Oh. I'm just like 
Imagine <laughs> Chuck coming in with <laughs> yoga pants. And a half shirt. And thinking about what would go through my mind. And <laughs> <laughs> it's everywhere. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Oh. I didn't know. I felt like I just got maced <laughs> by Punky <laughs> Juicer. Punky Juicer maced me. So there's video of him biting this other guy's face or what? I mean, probably so, yeah, can't so they even say watch that, it. But... Um, he ate oh, another he's... dude at a housing project. We can't. We probably can't listen. Yeah, I'm not. So I'm not. Um, I've got the sound off. Oh, that. Well, first of all, that guy got the better of him there. He <laughs> threw, him, threw him down <laughs> is, the stairs. Is he at a, does he live uh, at a housing project? I don't know. Um, okay, so yeah. he he's not good at fighting. No. But what he's going to do is just get close to this guy so and then bite. start chomping. Well, the other that guy know. knows that guy's running away from him. He knows. This is the worst fight I've ever seen it in my is. life. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh my God, is... oh. Jesus! <laughs> you you can't out, fight man. like that. No. What are they? Now doing? you know why it's not a World Star Hip Hop. Yeah. It's another site. <laughs> it should. It's a late on sissyfights.com. Is the worst fight <laughs> style. Oh God, look at this guy. <laughs> Luke, I, I, I don't want to see him. him. I'm sorry, but if you fight like a lady guy, I don't want to see him chew convert. someone's face. Though, I'm just saying, if I'm recorded in a fight with a man. In a half shirt and yoga pants. <laughs> I hope to God I am just filling that guy in. You better win. You know what I mean? You better win. I better look better, too, than this guy just sort of. Yeah, he, like, hits down. I've never seen anything oh. like it. Come on. Like, knock oh, him out. Well, yeah, like, the yoga pants guy obviously doesn't have any fighting form. Mm -mm. No. But the other guy should at least, I mean, even his punches were kind of like. Ugh. Yoga pants guy fights how I would probably. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I would. Uh, how Lisa would like you to believe. She exactly. Would yeah, Lisa, that, I think right. you would look tougher she's than the yoga a, pants yeah, guy. Yeah, exactly. Absolutely. She You're would. no punky juicer. And she's a train killer. Until she atomic blondes you. And, <laughs> yeah. Right. RKO's you out of nowhere. Exactly. Your nose is in your brain. Yeah. <laughs>